What's going on, Thompson's Kennels? Looky, looky what we got here. <laughs> this is Miss Hustle to BYK's Flash. Flash is a direct son off a of mailman. Aunt Nephew Breeden. Boyle Sorrel Cross. What's going on? Ah. And as you can see, these little jokers here. <laughs> Y'all are getting ready to go into a a bigger pen in the back as soon as I get enough time. Whew. Renovating the yard sucks, man. <laughs> you lose track of the, all the time you put into doing. These fuckers here are wild, man. Every, I mean, very small little, only three. But, I mean, they, they got a lot of character. I give them that. But, you know, you kind of lose track of renovating a yard and how much time and work you put into it and then having to restart it all over again, which I'm in the process of now. We've been here about a month, a month and a half, two months. So, you know, just getting there. But I'm going to do my little, I say years ago I wasn't going to do a yard tour until I got on the property. So I said I'll do a little yard tour now. This is still in progress, you know. Hard work, time and patience, that's all this is going to be. But I take it one day at a time. But we're going to start off. I usually start with old man beats, but my old friend is gone. So I'm starting with my little pups here. And this, like, like I said, this is um BY Backyard Kennels Flash Bred to Miss Hustle, which was an aunt nephew breeding. This is an infusion of the boiled sorrel blood. Second generation of it. And I'm really liking this cross. The dogs are coming out with a lot of character. Very intelligent, very alert, smart little dogs. And good size and bone. And great teeth as well. You gotta get ready to feed and water up. I'm gonna go ahead and try to make this quick. Watch your little feet. Let me start off with them. Alright, let's take a little walk. How am I gonna do this where it's the easiest way? Ain't no more little backyard no more. <laughs> Worst thing about this shit, man, you forget something, boy, you fucked. You gotta take a damn country mile walk to get the fucking rake or something. I'm gonna get to her. As you can see, my projects. <laughs> I had to cut all of those pine, um, those little saplings down burn all of this shit which i gotta do after i make this little video for you guys i appreciate everybody inquiring reaching out i do not have something for sale i have nothing for sale i will be doing some breedings this summer though some necessity breedings for my program if the lord blesses me and i get some big numbers you know i don't have a problem letting the dog go to the public but i breed for myself not for everybody else but we're going to start with this bitch. This is Black Sealy. She's a direct daughter off of Black Seal bred to Miss Pedro, which was a belly mate brother sister breeding. So she's an inbred dog, pure termite. A lot of the Red Boy Jocko termite dogs that I will be showing in the video will be a direct descendant to this dog here. Direct children and grandchildren to this bitch as far as the Red Boy Jocko termite dogs go. And this is Black Sealy. I love what she brings to the table. Very intelligent, hardworking bitch. Great mouth and a great mother and producing some very high quality dogs from the feedback that I've been getting. And she's good for killing some goddamn grass. So everywhere I want some grass put, or I mean some grass tucken out, I'll stick this bitch right there and she'll knock them down for me. You're getting real happy on this side. Work on that backside over there. Lord knows this weed needing is fucking killing me, boy. This shiesty looking motherfucker here <laughs> is ghost mad. That's my little boy right there. I ain't really got too much work in them dogs. I've been working out here too much to fuck with them. But I just picked up a rope and I can see how much, how focused they are into it. Yeah, you want that, don't you, boy? 
This is another inbred dog. He's a product of a brother-sister breeding. Hustle Man bred to the ghost dog is what produced Ghost Man and also his belly mate sister, Miss Trinidad. So, Ghost Man here, he's been bred once. Um, what is Ghost Man? I think three, going on four years old. As far as Sealy, she's four. And he's been bred one time. I bred him to my line bred um, Manny Bitch Cookie. And I, I will be showing some pups off of this dog right here, Ghost Man, in this video. <laughs> and he's fast as lightning. This is Ghost Man, a.k.a. Bite a Hole in Your Ass. He's nothing to play with, people. What's going on, my boy? He's ugly, long, and rangy. And most of all, I fucking love it. <laughs> this is his belly mate sister, Miss Trinidad. They're off the same litter. Belly mate means these dogs came off the same litter. This is Miss Trinidad. And this is another one that'll bite a hole in your ass. No joke. Serious dogs, they fully represent what Hustle Man was for my yard and for my program. These are direct offspring off of Hustle Man. And as you can see, long, rangy, athletic, the phenotype for the long wind, the elongated rib cage, the big barrel, lungs. You know, I believe breeding for wind is not it's a it's a physical thing that comes along with it from what i've seen over the years and like i said extremely long rangy moves like a cat you want that don't you girl don't you girl and this he can't get his way so this is what he'll start to do i ain't gonna get them too geesed up because i got a bunch of wood to burn but this is miss trinidad same ages ghost man off the same litter I have never bred this bitch. I bred her brother once, but I've never bred her. Probably gonna try and do something this summer with her. I kinda wanna see what she's throwing me. And like I said, extremely long, rangy. Some people say ugly, but I love it. <laughs> this bitch right here who acts like she's nice. This is Lady of Rage. This is seven years of breeding. She's a direct daughter off of PBC's Bam Bam Bread to Sweet Pea. Sweet Pea came off of my Miss Hustle dog. <sighs> Let me get this straight because, boy, that was a, a lot. Seven years of breeding. This is Bam Bam Bread to Sweet Pea. Sweet Pea was off of my Miss Hustle dog bred to her grandfather, which was Manny. So this is several years of line breeding. And she looks pretty. <laughs> she looks nice, but she's nothing nice. This dog has a horrible demeanor, <laughs> but I like her. She's growing on me, as you can see the bam bam in her face. She's very small, but she is rangy to be small. A lot of people get that confused, like a dog that's small can't have leg. That is not true, as you can see. She's lean as a whistle, and she moves like a cat too. What's going on, baby? Little hard body son of a bitch here. <laughs> this is Lady of Rage and shout outs to PBC for letting me acquire this bitch and like I said extremely lean hard body dog I just cleared out her spot we've been cutting and burning these pines and stuff but it looks like she always has a keep on and she eats like a horse but as you can see this is little Lady of Rage Gonna take this all the way around. All right, let's get to Black Gold. Black Gold is a direct daughter off of Black Silly, the first dog, large black bitch I showed you, heavy bred termite bitch. She's a direct daughter to Black Silly. Her father was PBC's Nilo, RIP. I had two dogs off of that um breed and i have her and russia a lot of people don't know black gold and russia are belly mate sisters i will be showing her belly mate sister later on in the video very large stocky intense little bitch as you can see very 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 similar to what her mother is i don't really get this dog a lot on video i don't know why but i i am gonna try and do a breeding with her 
sometime in the future. I just haven't decided where I want to exactly take it yet. But this is Thompson's Black Gold. She was produced here at Thompson's Kennels. So was Ghostman, so was Miss Trinidad. And yeah, she wants that thing back. <laughs> Always ready to work. And this right here is uh <laughs> This is my baby right here. This is Thompson's Proud Mary. She's about six going on seven years old. Um a lot of people who know Brown's Kennels, the Black Knight Dog, this is his belly mate sister, Proud Mary, one of my foundational bitches on my yard. I I have a daughter of Black Black Mary I'll be showing later on in this video as well. <laughs> She's just a jealous old bitch. <laughs> but um, Proud Mary is worth her weight in gold. Great mother, great producer. Um, she is the mother to the Trouble Man dog over there at St. Joe's Kennels. I mean, a lot of good dogs have come from Proud Mary. And like I said, she is an older dog. But she has a place here till she closes her eyes forever. Um, this is a very special dog to me. I had this dog a very long time, and I based a lot of my future moves around this dog. She was bred to Commando. She was bred to Hustle Man. This is a, a combination of the boils and garner blood. Heavy bread, leave a red on the bottom, pure boils on the top. This is a 50-50 split, and I, I love that combination of blood. And I'll show... Her daughter, um, Black Mary, and you can actually see what she looks like when she was probably three because they're not clones, but breeding for better would be a, a perfect example of what I'll show when I get to her daughter. But this is my, put this down, this is my baby girl, Mary. <laughs> What's going on, Mary? Big old cutters. Ugh. Let's keep it moving. This is long string bean ugly motherfucker here <laughs> is ghost man's son this is mega man i showed this dog as a little puppy in um my videos i didn't show him in a while he's still a little puppy but he shot up like a string bean overnight and he's cadillac long just like his daddy and just like his grandfather he is a grandson to hustle man and a direct son to ghost man he is a product of Ghost Man Bread to Cookie. I'll be showing Cookie later on in the video. This is a combination of the Balls and Bolio blend with a shot of Eli in there coming through the showgirl dog. This is a lot of years of breeding here. And like I said, he's not even a year. He's a very young puppy, long, rangy, and tall. He hit that um, string bean phase. But he's a very nice dog. What's going on, Mega Man? <laughs> Dude is focused. But I like him. He, he's, he, he shows a, a lot more intelligence than his grandfather did. And he, he's on the same pace as Ghost Man. But very long string bean. I like those Cadillac long dogs. I like athletic, long rangy dogs that move like cats. I don't, I'm not too big into the short stocky of bulldogs. But this is kind of my preference as far as what the Hustle Man blood goes through. And this is a Mega Man. Do 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 do. Watch out, boy. Don't don't trip me up. Show your ass on camera. This is Mega Man's belly mate sister. You kind of see a trend going. She's um wild bitch. Real wild bitch. Long rangy. Both of these are belly mate brother sisters. These are off of Ghost Man the Cookie. I said I'll show you guys how they've been doing. She hit that um string bean lanky stage. They both hit it at the same time. I'm in love with this bitch right here. So far, so good. Very intense. Like what she's bringing to the table. And like I said, these are direct kids off of Cookie and Ghost Man. What's going on, baby? What's going on? Um, Backyard Kennels had the... Uh, she came off... She was off the same litter with the bitch with no tail. Um, Backyard Kennels, got uh, my partners who own Flash, they got the sister with no tail. We'll be showing her in the future as well. If everything pans out with these dogs. This was only a four dog litter. Kendrick got one. I kept two. Backyard Kennels got one. And so far so good. No complaints from anybody about how these dogs are acting. 
for youngsters, you know, not shy, timid, none of the stuff that you don't really like to see in young bulldogs, very confident about what they're doing. And like I said, this is a belly mate sister to Mega Man. Young dog, not even a year. This bitch right here. This is um Thompson's Brooklyn. Brooklyn is a belly mate sister to Sosa. She is a direct daughter to Black Sealy as well. But she's not the same as Black Gold. She's a product of Young Buck bred to Black Sealy. Black Gold is a product of Nilo bred to back Black Sealy. Mostly all of the offsprings off of these dogs will come from Sealy in this video. And like I said, this is another young one. Let me get her out here in the light. This is Brooklyn. Young bitch, powerhouse. Fucking powerhouse. Love everything about this little dog. She kind of reminds me of a male. <laughs> and she's focused as all outdoors. Let's go to a baby girl. Good clean teeth on this bitch. Like I said, she's a young dog. Her and Sosa are off the same litter. And I, I, I like this little dog a lot. Haven't used her yet in the breeding program. She's still going through the 32 chambers. But as you can see, she's a fucking athlete. Very strong, very alert, very smart. Perfect representation of what I'm looking for. This is a half-sister to Black Gold. Same mother, different father. Like I said, most of these dogs you'll see here will be coming through. Um, my termite bitch, Silly. This um, monster here is Proud Mary's daughter. This is Black Mary. Black Mary is the product of Commando bred to Proud Mary. This is a perfect blend of the Boyles Eli Bolio combination. I've been blending this blood for years, and she looks like a male, but this is Black Mary. Got my dirt guy coming. I gotta get a load of dirt. Drop back here. But we're gonna show this bitch. She looks like a male. Complete powerhouse. This bitch is four years old, never been bred. I am gonna be breeding this bitch this summer when she comes in the season. I haven't made up my mind if it's going to be to Mailman or Hustle Boy, aka El Negro Pablo. But this is Black Mary. Very serious dog, very intense, nothing to fuck with. Come here, baby girl. Come here, baby girl. Can I show you teeth? You gonna let me show you teeth? I don't think she's gonna let me show her teeth. You gonna let me see him? Come on. This dog is zooted. <laughs> Fully mature, and like I said, never been bred. Very interested to see what she will produce. She is a female, built like a male. This is a blend of the Boyle's Eli Bolio blood, as I said. This was Commando. Commando. This is off of Commando and Proud Mary. I produced Commando. Commando came off a of cold crush bread to cookie. And then we took Commando to Proud Mary, which is Mary, Proud Mary and Cookie are half brother, half sister. So this, this is pretty much an entire breeding program that I started out with all condensed into one dog. And this is Black Mary. This is Yellow Wolf. I'll be showing his belly mate sister Yellow Queen in this video as well. Yellow Wolf is a direct son off a of buck. Actually, that's his daddy standing back there behind him. Yellow Wolf is a beast. This is young buck bred to, to Russia. So, so I'm not losing everybody. I took buck. No, hold on. We took Nilo to Black Sealy, which produced Russia. Russia and Black Gold are off the same litter. We took Russia to Young Buck to produce Yellow Wolf here. Yellow Wolf here is a combination of Nilo, Young Buck, and Black Sealy. Very nice young dog. My wife loves this motherfucker. He is um, fully loaded. I mean, he's a puppy. But God, golly, man, he's intense. <laughs> What's going on, Yellow Wolf? What's going on, son? What's going on, son? This is my boy right here. And he's not even a year, but he's a monster. As you can see in size, he's no joke. He's almost the size of his father, and like I said, I don't even think he's a year yet. Like um, the more heavier boned, shorter, stockier dogs, you can kind of see where I was leaning in my program to for that. 
And Young Buck has been throwing that for me for years now. Come here, Yellow Wolf. Come here, son. That's my boy here. He's just a youngster. I'll be showing his half-brother, Sosa, as well in this video. But let's show his daddy. Come here, Big Buck. This is my boy, Buck. Young Buck is the father to Brooklyn. He's the father to Sosa. He's the so father to Yellow Queen. He's the father to Yellow Wolf. And he is solid as an ox. Solid dog here. We bred him to Russia to produce Yellow Wolf. And Young Buck, what's going on, my man? This is my son right here. Good dog, good dog. Big cutters in his head, too. And he's been throwing me some good ones. And he's hard as a rock. And I don't have no work in any of these fucking dogs. I've been cutting trees and clearing land and having loads of dirt dropped and spreading shit. I have no work in these dogs whatsoever. And everybody who know me, it ain't no capping with me. This is just them on the chain. This is Young Buck. One of my foundational males when it comes to the Red Boy Jocko Termite stuff. We have him bred to Sealy, which produced Sosa in Brooklyn, which I showed. And I guess I'll just mosey on down to Russia. This is probably one of the most popular dogs that I own as far as everybody. Um, this is Russia. What's going on, Rush? What's going on, Rush? She's a happy, enthusiastic dog. But don't think for a second that she ain't a bulldog. This is um, this is just a, a beautiful specimen. The black gold dog that I showed earlier in the video, this is her belly mate sister. Both of them are off the same litter. This is the red boy Jocko termite stuff. Nilo bred to black Sealy. Heavy cruise, heavy termite, game islands termite on the bottom. And she's an athlete, freakish athlete for her size. Um, she's only been bred once. Yellow Wolf and Yellow Queen. I'll be showing her daughter Yellow Queen coming up very shortly in this video. And everybody who got something off of that litter, they've been calling me and they've been very pleased. Her and um, Young Buck threw it down. This is Red Boy Jocko Termite at its finest. You want that rope, don't you, girl? Don't you, girl? Don't you, girl? Don't you, girl? <laughs> Absolutely no work in this dog. Beautiful specimen. <laughs> loves the work and I mean loves belly rub. She's just a probably all all around one of my um most well rounded dogs. I I don't know what I'm thinking about doing a boils cross with her in the future. I haven't made my mind up yet. Still too early to tell. Shout outs to Miss Joni Winchester. This is my pure sorrels dog. This is Maha. The puppies that I showed in the beginning of this video are her grandkids. Everything you could want in a dog. This dog has added so much intelligence. She's added thickness of the hide. She's, ad she's added bone structure. She really complemented what I wanted to do with the boils blood that I have. And great dog here. And she will put a hole in one. She is. I don't know when people started thinking Sorrel's dogs were for play, but they're not. This is a perfect example of it. She is a great bitch. Super intelligent. Problem solver. She's broken out of kennels. She's broken out of anything you can put this fucking dog in. She sits there and observes what you do, how you do it. If you open the door a certain way, she will mimic what you do. That's why she's on the chain. <laughs> but this is Mean Maha. Mean Maha is the mother... To Flash, I bred Mailman directly to her. She's about four and a half, five. I think she's five. I got to look at her paperwork. She's five years old. I only bred this bitch once, but I've only had to breed her once because what she threw was so phenomenal. And I bred her to my Mailman dog. And Mailman, we'll get to him later on in this video. But Maha right here, she's a grandmother, and I'm glad to say I got some grandkids off of her. And like I said, I haven't had to breed this bitch a whole ton. I may do something in the future with her, but I'm kind of seeing how many generations I can go before the cross needs to be reinstilled because the blood has been carrying on very well generational wise for me. And like I said, just um, shout outs to Tatanka Kennels. 
And shout outs to Miss Winchester for allowing me to acquire this dog because she really wasn't even trying to sell that dog. I, I, I had to damn near talk her into get, letting me get this one. But this is the foundation of the Boyle Sorrel combination that I started. If you're familiar with APBT for the love of the game, if you're familiar with Kendrick Kennels, they have offsprings off of that breeding. And like I said, this is Maha, I think five, I wouldn't shock me if she's about five, five and a half. I'm, I got to look at that paperwork, but she's only been bred once and phenomenal dog. <laughs> and like I said, beautiful dog. All right, this deranged looked in. <laughs> Come here, man. This is Hustle Boy. Heavy bred boils. Heavy bred boils dog. Never been bred. This is Miss Hustle bred back to Manny, which was her grandfather. And like I said, he's a workaholic. Come here, son. Workaholic. He's about 30 pounds soaking wet of just pure energy. I have a lot of videos of me working this dog. This dog is the definition of stamina and win. I love everything about him. I'm getting ready to breed him this summer. I was thinking about breeding him to um, Black Mary, the large black bitch that I showed you earlier in the video. But uh, he's getting up there in age. I got to get him bred. I want to see what he's throwing. I uh, believe he's about five. Uh, also known as AKA El Negro Pablo. Ah! Getting old, you start making them old man noises. Come here, boy. You always wanna act shy when the camera come out for some fucking reason. Come here, boy. Take the camera off, he's running around fucking shit up as you can see. Hey, hey. Oh no, don't grab it. <laughs> He's a wild one. He's real herky-jerky. But I just love the way he works. He, he works with such a commitment that you just can't... You can't help but love it. And like I said, heavy bred boils. This dog is heavily, heavily bred. He's kind of one of those dogs I keep around just as insurance for certain other dogs because his the blood that's in him has been compounded. As I said, this was Miss Hustle bred back to her grandfather. So, just to kind of give you a definition... This is Hustle Man. This is Manny. This is <laughs> this is a lot of my foundational dogs all compounded. I mean Beretta, aka PBC's Foxy Brown. Everybody's in his pedigree. Um, he's he's really an insurance dog for me. So I keep him nice and happy. And like I said, this is El Negro Pablo, aka Hustle Boy, aka Shiesty. Now y'all about to see this goddamn workhorse here. This is Yellow Queen. This is a belly mate sister to Yellow Wolf. This is the, let me get out get out her way because she'll fucking leg sweep you. This bitch right here. This is Yellow Wolf's sister. This is a direct. This is the direct daughter to Russia. I just showed her earlier. This is um Young Buck times Russia. She looks like a male extremely strong and like i said this is just a puppy a lot of these dogs are young I, I never understood people that could just breed dogs and don't actually keep shit off of what they breed how the fuck do you know if it's good or not but this is yellow queen and as i said she is built like a brick fucking house i'm very cognizant of how i walk in her chain spot because like i said she will leg sweep you a fucking mouse could fart in the woods and she'll take off and you'll be laying on the fucking ground <laughs> moves like a cat i really like this dog i can see russia and buck in this bitch and silly it's really really impressive dog to be a youngster i got real high hopes for this bitch hoping she pans out when she gets older but so far i'm very pleased with her i have nothing to really change about this bitch and like i said this is young buck bred to russia red boy jocko termite this war horse here is Mailman. Everybody's pretty much familiar with Mailman. This is straight gasoline. No brakes. No, no nothing. Um, he's only been bred once. He, we bred him to Maha, the Sorrels dog, to produce the Flash dog. I will probably be breeding him this summer just to get some more offspring off of him. Um... 
he just sees anything in it's work time which is a trait that I love in my dogs I can't stand lazy dogs I just want y'all to hear his jaws y'all hear that this is intensity Just hear that. Just hear that, son. He'll hurt your feelings real bad. Serious dog. Mailman is off a of hustle man bred to AKA Foxy Brown Beretta. I did not keep his mother because she was a hot. That horrible noise you heard was from um, my sorrows dog. This right here is um, one of my main dogs, even though I never had to breed him a lot either because his offspring are doing so well for me. This is Mailman. <laughs> He's off a of hustle man bred to Foxy Brown, AKA Beretta. His mother was a horrible puppy killer. I was blessed to have three pups, him and Miss Hustle and Lady in Brown. I kept him and Miss Hustle, and I let my part partner get Lady in Brown because she just reminded me too much of the mother. So the, the phenotype, I went complete polar opposite with his belly mate sister, Miss Hustle, and I kept these two dogs. I bred his sister, Miss Hustle, more than him. I only bred him once, and I, I did three breedings with his sister. And like I said, this is, um, this is intensity. And he'll hurt your feelings real bad. This is probably about the heaviest you'll ever see this dog on my yard. Because like I said, I haven't really been working him. I've been too busy trying to get this property together. As you can see, my stack of wood and stuff. I got to get ready to do my little burn barrels. Um, just devastation. It's extremely destructive animal. I will tell you, I'm, I'm very, I'm honest dog, man. I don't cut corners and I don't bullshit people. He's very destructive, but it's something that I can tolerate. Everybody else may not be able to tolerate that. But he's very destructive. He's he, the shit's in your face. It ain't nothing to play with. It ain't for everybody. Moves like a cat, and he's got jaws like a bear trap. And like I said, you hurt your feelings real bad. <laughs> this is my baby girl. This is um, Miss Hustle. This is Mailman's belly mate sister, which means they're off the same litter. When I say lineage, I got lineage. I don't say the shit just to be saying it. <laughs> This is um, one of my little prides and joys here. She's a great mother. She's nothing like her mother, which is a great thing. She's a great, she takes care of her puppies. And so far we haven't, she hasn't had a daughter that's turned out to be a bad mother either. Um, Sweet Pea is directly off of this bitch. This is the grandmother to Lady in Rage, the brown bitch I started off early in the video. What's going on, Miss Hustle? This is my baby girl right here. Great work ethic, great mother, great producing dog. I mean, it's really, I mean, that's pretty much what you can say. Heavy boils breeding. And like I said, this is mailman's belly mate sister. And they both are getting up there in age, but they're worth their weight in gold for me. Ugh. All right, boy. All right, son. <laughs> This is the next up and coming one for me. This is um, Thompson Sosa. Sosa is a belly mate brother to um, the Brooklyn dog I showed you early in the video. This is um, a very young dog, but physical specimen, physical freak. And like I said, I got high hopes for this little one here. Physically, he's everything I wanted. This is Buck bred to Sealy. Termite on the bottom, Tans AAA on the top. Red Boy Jocko Termite. Him and Brooklyn are belly mate brothers and sisters. Yet again, like I said, I'm very pleased with this young dog. I don't, I don't, kind of want to say 15. I gotta look at their paperwork, man. I'm getting, must be getting old. I don't remember shit, but uh, he's a very young dog. I don't even think he's lifting his leg to piss yet. But don't let that fool you either, because he's got bad intentions about what he's doing. 
very young dog, but I'm very pleased with this fucking animal, man. Very pleased with him. And like I said, I don't have a lick of work in him. This is just him on the chain. If y'all look at the prior videos I've been putting up, I put him here and there was grass everywhere. It didn't take him too while, too long to, to kill everything. Yeah. I just like to see. <laughs> he ain't take his eyes off me yet either. <laughs> you was huh? <laughs> but this is Sosa. I got high hopes for this guy. He he's my next up and coming one. This will be the catalyst for um Young Buck. This is a direct son off of Young Buck. So I'm gonna be doing some things with him in the future. Just so I can prove a point. And that pretty much consists of what I want to show. <laughs> I appreciate everybody for the love and support over the years. You know, it took a long time to get here to this type of situation. With kennels and property and all that shit. You know, I just stayed focused and kept my grind going. And, you know, if you want to do it, you can do it, you know. Less talk, more walk. You know, I just keep it 100 with the young bulls. Less talk, more fucking walk. You know what I mean? You could talk about it, but do it. You know, that's the only way you're going to achieve shit in this world. Because ain't nobody going to give you shit. <laughs> and I got it out the mud. And so far, we getting there. The property still has a long way to go. But I'm getting there one day at a time. As I get ready to burn some wood. Got my little barrel. Got my little wood cut up from yesterday. And boy, I got some weed eating to do. But I don't want to make this too long. Just wanted to show the yard, some of our upcoming males that we'll be using, some of our prospects. None of these dogs are for sale that I showed in this video. Just a, a, a little yard tour. I kind of wanted to get a video of how it looked now and compared to what it's going to look like in the next four months when I get the last bit of the renovating that I want to get done out here with this property. But from Thompson's Kennels, y'all have a blessed one. A little continuation. This is Cookie. I forgot to add her in the video. Cookie is the mother to the Mega Man. <laughs> and the little black bitch that I showed in the video. I just ended the motherfucker and I guess she was saying, yo, what about me, motherfucker? I'm your foundation, bitch. <laughs> Cookie is the grandmother to Black Mary as well. Commando is a direct son off of Cookie. This is how long this dog goes back for some people who don't know. This is line bred on A. Graham's Manny. Heavy boils, bitch. 75% boils, 25% Eli with the buck blood. Very nice. Bitch hair, she's been throwing good for me. She is an old bitch. She's a little, a tad bit older than Proud Mary. I think Mary's about six going on seven. I think she's already seven years old. I'm trying to keep up with these ages and shit like time flies. She's a very old dog. And like I said, I bred her to Ghost Man, which was an inbred son off a of Hustle Man. And I showed the pups off a of Ghost Man and her in the vid. I just wanted to go ahead and throw her in here because she she did never forgave me if I ain't show her. This is um, Thompson's cookie. And you can't tell that she's an old bitch because she ain't going to let you know it. Yeah, her, her parents are Manny, bred to Bodacious, which was a father-daughter breeding, which produced her. Brown owns Bodacious now, but that was a PBC breeding. This was what, probably one of the first, this was the first dog. Ah! This was one of the first dogs I had acquired from him. And it turned out to be a great specimen. Line breeding, father-daughter. Y'all have a blessed one again.